all washed up, kind of, sort of. Travis washed it. Travis washed it, didn't he? Oh. This. Yeah, he washed it. Said he did. What are you doing, David? What are you doing earlier? Play some chopping knives for, yeah. the, for the corn stalks. Chop them down nice and low. New lawnmower beans. Yeah, they're in here. Yep. Yeah. Wanna you know what I'm doing? Uh, sure. Why don't you tell us? I'm fixing cases mistakes. Hold on. Okay. This goes up in here. Got the chain welded on these height sensors right here. Goes up here. Oh, yeah. See this one over here? Piece of tin put in there. I put that in. I was in on it. I was in on it. And then you got this one. Busted all the pieces. Where it went out to get it. I'm going to try to put a spacer in here so that won't go up quite as high. Mm. That's just pure stupidity doing that that way. That's true. That's just proof. Just because you got green engineering, don't mean you're an engineer. <laughs> well, you know what you call the engineer that got all these? An engineer. <laughs> Garrett's washing his sprayer. We are done spraying till fall spraying. Finally, it lasts a long time. Me, Corey, George, going to Indiana to get the uh, get the bean irrigations fired up. They need a little water, and also fire up the corn ones. We're gonna put water on with them, but we're mostly just getting them in the what position we want them to be sitting in this fall, so they're easier to work around. But we might as well. Give them one last shot of water while we're getting them there, and then uh, that'll be it for irrigating the corn. Been running around this morning, checking to make sure uh, the irrigations that we're supposed to be on are still on, and the ones that were supposed to shut down a certain spot, shut down in that spot. And I forgot about having the camera, so I didn't show you any of this. Uh, just got to this one here. Had a fuel leak, it could, could get the run yesterday. Uh, ended up being the problem lines jiggle loose on the injectors tighten them up give it the mint seal run and it is not all right never mind antifreeze leak in the radiator have an extra one that they had to take off earlier this year david and then had to fix the clutch pack on it's fixed now so i'm gonna go get it use it take this one to the shop later to repair so then we have this one as an extra new motor set up hopefully running it's gonna run so far so far <laughs> that's better than not yet it ain't over yet. <laughs> oh there he comes Comes the soil warrior. What's a wide load?
Ditch are ready. Corey's gonna go pick culvert. I'm gonna go mow. Yellow equipment everywhere. Teeth, we're gonna grind it right up. Take care of some little trees on a ditch bank. Pulling Corey across the old Wabash Cannonball, across the mighty Wabash River. Won't have any video of him putting in the culvert because he don't have a camera. Won't have much of mine because I forgot to charge it. I only had 13%. As you can see, we got a lot of little trees that the mower just can't reach. They rob sunlight, rob nutrients, block the ditch. Here's your little before. Here's your little after. Much better. Like I said, I don't have much battery because I forgot to plug it in, but uh, I have a little video of this anyways.